Oh, how we've missed him. This was classic Mick Mouldhouse, ideas about everything, with the AFL in his sights. Far from happy with some of the NAB Cup trial rules. Uh, the last touch of the line is ridiculous because it just murders players. They can't go a yard in the last quarter. And that's when you have, your, when you have total fatigue, you have breakdowns. If we're going to have the 80 rule, please let us coach. So if I want to use 50 in the first quarter and 10 in the last, let me coach the side. And if the league persists with an interchange cap, he says it'll nullify the impact of so-called burst players. I, I think players that are six-minute players who just get on and just burst and really give us something to look at, they, then they're going to be eight or nine players. So you might you might not have the same type of game player playing. He'll play, that player will play because he's good enough, but he won't be playing the same dynamic type of game. So we're, we're changing everything, really, which is a little bit of a shame in many respects. So they're the changes he's worried about, but by the same token... Here I am saying, don't change the games. I'd change it that you can't pick the football up when you're on the... When you're on the ground, you should not be able to touch the football. Oh, sorry, pick it up. You can tap it out, knock it out, kick it out, but you can't pick it up. Malthouse is looking forward to Saturday night's pre-season hit-out against Fremantle. Another chance to test his game style, which he openly admits his players are taking time to adjust to. I'm prepared and know that this is going to take some time to implement and I've got to be patient and I uh, unfortunately patience is for the dead so it doesn't really suit me but I'll have to live with it. Key forward Jared Waite still won't be out there and is in doubt for round one with a calf complaint but at the other end of the ground the Dockers will be without skipper Matthew Pavlich his wife is expecting. Yeah, look, it's an exciting time uh, for two reasons. One, the season starting and, and clearly the birth of your first child is um, probably one of the biggest moments, if not the biggest moment in your life. So, um, yeah, it's not too far away. Within a, a few weeks now, and um, it looks like we've got the leave pass for this weekend, Ross. Thank you for that. So, we'll uh, get that out of the way, as bad as that sounds, and then uh, focus on football. I don't think it's for me to be talking about their private life, but certainly... You know, him flying into state would put that at risk, so he won't play. Lyon playing down the significance of Aaron Sanderland's hamstring injury. Well, it's a, it's a hamstring, so it's about the size of a hamstring. Um, but he's obviously an important player to us, but we, we, we don't want to rely on any one player. So we're really confident in John Griffin and Zach Clark and Kepler Bradley and Jack Hanna. Matt Thompson, AFL.com.au.